Okay, now let's create a video views ad. So I've quickly gone and made a couple of different videos for you to check out. Some were made using resources that require you to pay for the download or subscribe to a monthly subscription to get the download and some of them will allow you to share the video for free. So this is my favorite one on Biteable. And just so you know, um, this does require an upgrade to download, but this is what it looks like. It was really easy to make. It took me probably less than five minutes. Um, and yeah, I'm really pleased with the outcome. Um, it's something you should definitely check out. And if you have the cash to spare, I think this is probably the best place to go to create videos. So that's that. And then we have, um, I'm not sure how to pronounce it, Magisto, Magisto. Now this one isn't too great, I don't believe, because the sizing's all out and I did it really quickly. And you know, ideally you want some better photos than that. But this will allow you to share a link. You can share it on your personal Facebook timeline or you can click the link and then you can share it off your page, which I'll do now. Fetching preview, here we go. Um, and you would just publish it with a caption. Okay, that's there. And then you'd head over to your ads manager. I'm just gonna refresh. Gonna create a campaign. Video views, because that's what this video is for. I'm just going to pretend all this is done because you know we've seen all this before. I'm just going to change that though. Okay, so select my page. In fact, I'd use an existing post, select my page, and then I'd select a page post. and it should appear here. Now, it isn't appearing here at the moment. And actually, I think that's because the only issue with um, sharing a link is, um, as you can see, I've posted it off my page here, but because I haven't actually uploaded it as a page post, like if I click write something, and then you would upload the video here because I've just pasted it as a link like that. Um, it doesn't actually show as a page post to select to boost because that's what it should do. But because we're running a video views ad, um, the selected page post drop down only shows posts where you've uploaded a video. So you can't actually use Magisto videos if you aren't going to upgrade, if you're just going to use the public link share option and share it off your page like that, you can't actually boost this post as a video views. I'm pretty sure you could do it as a PPE ad though. Anyway, I'm just going to delete that because I don't actually want it on the timeline. So that's Magisto and Biteable. Um, quickly, these are the prices for Biteable. And Story Express will allow you to create free videos. It does have a watermark, which isn't ideal, and you can download the video. Download video as. And 
that's that. Obviously, that is pretty bad um, by all standards. I don't actually like that video, but Story Express is currently the only place I know of where you can actually really quickly create videos with, if you don't have any video editing or video creation experience. Um, it's the only place I know of where you can create and download these for free. The upgrade will get rid of the watermark, I'm sure. Anyway, so now that I've downloaded it, I am going to create my video views ad. Single video. Note that um, the name of the video will be visible to people if you're uploading it to Facebook um, as a page post. So do make sure that the file name is named something relevant. So it's just uploading now. That was quite quick. And again, you type in some text and it'll be... I'll do the same as I did. That is probably the worst video I've ever created. Just gonna let you know. And anyway, you then place your order once you're happy with it. Might take a while to process, there we go. Your advert has been reviewed. So that's how you create a video views ad. Very simple, you just upload in a video to the ad creative section. So now I've got our PPE, our page likes, and our video views ad. These two have been running because I did these yesterday. Been running quite a bit. And the reason I've let these run is because later in the course we're gonna be using the data um, received to fine-tune and constrain our ads. Anyway, um, just a quick recap, you've got Biteable, which is you've got to upgrade to download, um, and you've got Magisto, where you can actually share the video, but you cannot use it in a, a video views ad because you have to upgrade to download, and you've got